Kia ora boys and girls, welcome. Today I'm going to read you a story by Jackie French and Bruce Whaley, and it's called Too Many Pears, as in the things you eat. And there's a cow on the front. Pamela, great name there, Pamela liked pears. Pamela liked fresh pears. She even liked pears more than Amy did. Pinched it out of her hand, didn't she? Pamela liked pears for lunch. Going to school. Obviously, Pamela goes to school. Pamela liked pears on picnics. Pamela liked stewed pears with ice cream too. Bit funny having a cow come right into your dinner table. Pamela liked pear pie with ice cream. She just picked it up out of the window and off she went. Pamela liked picking pears. And so did Amy and Grandma. We have to save our pears, cried Amy. Pears are my favourite. Amy picked lots of pears, but Pamela picked more. Grandpa built a fence around the pear tree. But Pamela crawled through a wombat hole under the fence. Where do you think this book was written? Grandma tied Pamela up. But Pamela took the tree, pear picking too. We'll never get any pears, everyone moaned. I know what to do, declared Amy. She had a bright pear idea. Pamela, uh, Amy set the table for Pamela. And there were brown pears and green pears. There were yellow pears and red pears. There were pears in chocolate sauce. Mm -hmm. There were baked pears and pear cream cake and a dish of pears as high as the roof. Oh my goodness. Pamela had a big smile on her face. Pamela ate one pear, then she ate another pear, and another, and another, and another, and another, and yes, you guess it, another. Pamela ate 600 pears. And then she stopped. Pamela wasn't smiling anymore. She felt sick. Didn't she? The next day, Grandpa opened the gate for Pamela. Look at all the lovely pears, Pamela. Pamela wasn't interested. Pamela was gazing at the apples. <laughs> Too many pears. Makes me think of Christmas and sometimes we stuff ourselves full of things, don't we? And we feel quite sick afterwards. Better to share around. That's a good message of Christmas. Share around. Around with other people in your family, with your neighbours, with people who don't have very much. Give away. That's a good thing to do at Christmas. Make you feel less sick too. Have a great week. Bye.